What's going on, Poke Peeps? It's Poke Diz coming at you once again. As you can see, we are out hunt again for some Pokemon cards here, like usual. But actually, we got a little bit of a special guest today. Mr. KC has actually joined us for the hunt, for just a little bit of it. Yeah. I'm actually splitting up this hunt into two days so I can get a lot of hunting done, so we can have a lot of product for our lives as well. But we're actually at our first stop of this day. It's be, it's actually a Wednesday, and then I'm gonna record again on Friday for this video right now that's actually on Saturday. Happy Saturday to every single one of you guys. We're about to go into this tar yeah, there it is over here and actually see what they have in for us KC you ready to go buddy I'm ready man it's been a while <laughs> it has been a while man it's good to see you Thanks. and actually I wanted to show you a little gift that KC actually got for us which I don't know why he's getting me anything because he got a new house and a new baby but we're about to show you right now but he got an awesome car that I want to show you as well that he pulled from one of his few packs of evolving skies that he was actually able to get all right so gift number one from KC is something that I have actually not been able to find in the wild and it's also got an Umbreon pack in it he knows me the EV promo card for Evolving Skies. Love that. Then he also got, you can see it's my favorite boy up top. He actually got these three tins that he got from Family Dollar, right? Dollar General. Dollar General, my apologies. The right. Snorlax, which I absolutely had to get this one. He also got us the Dark Rye. Love that card too. And then he also got us the Mimikyu. Yep. Absolutely insane gift. Thank you so much for that, buddy. Mm -hmm. I love the actual back of them. You guys can see these are not the dollar packs. It's one of three full cards as well as three packs. But I've heard that they've actually Actually got some burning shadows in there uh it's actually sword and shield sword and shield yeah, never yeah, mind so yeah. they actually got sword and shield packs uh, in there i've seen video uh one rebel clash one darkness ablaze one vivid vault so they're okay. like charizard and chonka chu chance <laughs> Woo! we got a chonka chu chance there's some vivids in there so we're gonna open up these obviously in the future but thank you so much casey for that you yeah, rock man. buddy thanks all right so here is casey's basically favorite card that he has gotten so far from evolving skies i would love to get it go ahead and turn it over buddy Ooh, guys, Rayquaza of Emax, Rayquaza of Emax. In in one of your sealed things, you're gonna keep sealed for a while, weren't you? Yeah, absolutely. I I haven't had uh, much evolving skies just because we've been moving and having a new baby. Mm -hmm. But I picked up maybe 10, 15 packs, and this just happened to be <laughs> in one of them. And Jeez, these nuts. and these these set in a box on my desk for a good week two weeks maybe three because i just hadn't had time to open them oh, until recently oh <laughs> sitting in a box on his desk there you go guys you never know until you open it so now after seeing all that let's go inside and see what this target has for us well guys casey always brings a good look because we got some chilling rain and battle styles but we don't really care about that we care about that right there look at all those tens guys vaporeon jolteon probably got some flareons back there i see right there casey you so lucky I try, man. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, we're probably going to get a few of these today because, you know, I've been opening up quite a few and getting some good hits here, guys. Spoiler alert. So I think I'll probably just get one of each of them. Well, nothing in the back. They got some top ramen and what looks like to be some Naruto dressed figures right here. I do like that. Got some Animaniacs, though, up top. Some SpongeBob, too. And is that Bill? I think that's Bill or Bob. I can't remember, but I love minions. And then Miss M's favorite right here, the Stitches. And is that a bucket of chicken? That's a bucket of chicken. That is a bucket of chicken. Finger looking good. And here's the Pokemon section in the back. Not too much going on. They got those awesome walkie-talkies. Talking Pikachu real cool. Oh, they actually got a DBZ pack yeah, over there. I actually may grab that. Grab that Cross Spirits for me. Is it the last one? Yep. Last pack magic. They got all these silver figures too, but as you guys know, I already got my Charmander and I'm not really interested in getting the whole set though, sadly. Honestly, if they were like the real, you know, colored ones, I'd definitely get all four. Speaking of more giant silver <laughs> things that I really don't want to get, <laughs> these are some more right here with the Bulbasaur. I love it, but it's not the normal pain. I think this might be as big as Elvis, honestly. That is, you know what? That, <laughs> that, that actually may be bigger than Elvis. Okay, this thing's pretty cool. I gotta say, holiday calendar. Miss M, just saying, Christmas is on the way if you're watching this. Love the collectibles area, as usual, guys. Got these Batman classic TV series from the 66 Batman with uh, Adam West and Burt Ward. Those, those are actually really cool with a pow and a wham, kapow. I know he may have been a creep, but that was no reason to remove his head. Okay, I'm interested in this one, not this one. This one, not this one. But what in the world would he be doing by shaking right there? What's he shaking? What's Batman shaking? I need to know. Well, they actually did have some stuff in there. You guys saw all those tins they had. I did pass up on the battle styles as well as the chilling rain blisters because 
Chilling pain. We've already <laughs> opened a lot of it. But I did get one of each of those EV tins as well as getting that Cross Spirits DBZ pack. So can't wait to open that. Me and KC are actually about to head to our next stop. I should say stops because it's in one place. We're going to the mall. All right, so now we are here at the mall and we're about to see what they got in here. We're going to GameStop as well as Think Geek. All right, GameStop, let's see what you got. Oh yeah, they got a bunch of Pokemon stuff here, guys. They got that Greninja box in the back that I'm pretty sure KC's about to grab. All right, so they got some awesome stuff in here too for Pokemon. I've never seen this before guys it looks like you charge it by putting your phone on top of pikachu's tail if his face wasn't looking so weird i'd probably get it probably the most realistic thing here you know pikachu charging your phone mm -hmm. i mean yeah that's pretty i mean besides the ports on the side of his body <laughs> mm, plastic, pikachu. Yeah, plastic pikachu somebody stabbed you oh i really like these statues down here too guys they got kang as well as rocksteady that is awesome from teenage mutant ninja turtles Love these so much. Not a hefty price tag either. Only 30 bucks per. They got these Super Ramas down here too, which is also pretty cool. Got Thanos, which I like. Gamora. Got a little Hulk action right here. Thor up top. Probably my favorite one though is going to be that Spider-Man though. Gotta love it. He's doing a stretch though. though. Probably hurt me severely. Well guys, I thought I was going to Think Geek as well, but um, this is Think Geek right here. And it's... Uh, it's closed. It's closed. KC, I'm really glad you found some of that GameStop, though. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, so a fruitful hunt. Sadly, they, you know, Think Geek is closed, but Mr. KC did pick up this awesome Greninja box, and you guys know from our last video, their cards are really cool in there, so I can't wait for him to actually open up his packs, see if he didn't get an error pack like us. After 25 years, Pokemon has Exodia, guys. <laughs> they have Exodia. They have Exodia. They have followed in the footsteps of Yu-Gi-Oh. It's awesome. So Casey's going back to work. I'm actually ending the hunting for today. We will pick it up on Friday, but I just wanted to stop by this mall as well as finding some for KC because he didn't get anything at that Target, so I'm really glad that we found something here. Buddy, it's always good to see you. Yeah, man. Always good to see you. <laughs> I'll see y'all soon. Probably in clip in like three, two, one. One eternity later. And what feels like an eternity just passed. It is now Friday and we are back out on the hunt. We are at Barnes and Nobles, my favorite one to see if we can get this hunt started back right. I'm on the hunt for the other two V Union boxes. If we can find the Zacian or the Mewtwo, I'm gonna be super happy. Let's see what they got. Okay, so we are actually on the hunt also for those Yu-Gi-Oh tens and this Barnes and Noble did absolutely have some. So I'm getting two because that's the max. My buddy sent me a total of cash for five. So I'm still looking for three more. I may get like a few packs while I'm here though. Let's go up the escalator and see if they got anything cool up top. This is new. I like this with all the pillows. That's really cool. Look at the snake right there, the Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff, Gryffindor. Look at that. That's the lion right there. Oh, uh, we got some Pokemon stuff over here. We got that Pikachu that we love and the Piplup that Miss M loves right there. We already got both those. They still got a lot of these figures down here though. The Pidgeot, the Charizard, as well as the Pikachu. And I think that, yep, yeah, Pikachu right behind that too. They still got a lot of these. I'm kind of surprised. And two of those Snorlax thingies. I still want one. All right, so sadly no V Union cards in there, but that's okay. We did pick up two of those Yu-Gi-Oh tins that my buddy did pay me already for. He wants me to open those on the channel too, so extra content and then i also picked up two packs of chilling pain and hopefully it's not too painful for us today let's go ahead and head to our next stop of the day and see what else we can find and here we are at our next stop we got a big old walmart let's see what they got in there for us all right well look at that guys we actually do got some stuff we got some tins right here let's move that out of the way so we got two vaporeons looks like two flareons and two jolteons you know what i'm gonna choose my favorite i'm gonna choose the one in the back this is the one that was almost forgotten. Let's go ahead and pick this up today, but no Yu-Gi-Oh! tins I'm seeing here, guys. That's okay, though. We're still looking for those. No worries whatsoever. Really glad we got some Pokemon, though. And then they got all these clippies here, too. I love these things. Oh, and look what we got here, guys. We got some Pokemon Oreos. We're gonna get some of these today, too. Now that we got our snacks and our cards, let's see what else they got in the back. And we found the Pokemon stuff in the back, and they actually do got some more stuff. They actually got one of these Lucario tins. I've yet to find one of those, so I'm picking that up today for sure sun and moon etb always nice as well they got some of the alakazam boxes right here and some of the eternatus v max boxes too passing on those actually both of those because we've opened up quite a few they also got some tins down below too guys some of the zashian and zamazenta 
tens. Very nice. And something I hadn't seen in forever. Sun and Moon GX Challenge Box. Very nice. So we're taking this Lucario tin as well. This is why you always have to check the back. Wow, it's starting to become a tin party today. We're finding all kinds of tins during this hunt. Still looking for the V Union box, especially the Mewtwo one. I definitely want to find that, but we've got a lot of tins so far back at the cave now. It's absolutely crazy. It's going to be a tin party on Sunday's stream. I'll tell you that right now. But let's go ahead and head to our next stop and see if we can finally find that Mewtwo V Union. And here we are at our next stop. We're making another Barnes and Nobles because we found those tins in the last Barnes and Nobles. And I want to see if we can find any more. Oh, we got some Pokemon stuff back here. Got that partner Pikachu. Always got to love that Charizard right there. They got Toxtricity over here too. I like that. Oh, and there he is. Hunta Hunta. They also got some of these Snorlax things here. God, I got to get one of these someday. Oh, that's cute. Miss Anne would love this one. Lilo and Pudge. That's her little fish. She feeds him peanut butter sandwiches. Okay, so I wasn't actually able to film at the register. The guys with it here at this Barnes & Nobles were not too comfortable with it, but that's okay. I'm not mad at them whatsoever because they had this Zacian box behind the counter, guys. We finally found some V Union on our hunt that we haven't opened. We did find the one with KC, the Greninja, but we let him pick that up because we already got it. Still looking for that Mewtwo, though. Also snagged up two more of these Yu-Gi-Oh! tins. My buddy, he actually sent me more money, so I'm going to get a total of seven for him. We got four. We need three more. May not find it in this hunt, but we'll definitely find it in our future ones. I'll tell you that right now. So let's go ahead to our next stop of the day, guys. Maybe our last of the day and see what else we can find. You know, Barnes & Nobles has been so awesome to us. Let's actually make it our last stop, too. We got another one. As always, my favorite section. Let's see what they got. Oh, I always love seeing this bookend. Love the terrain so much. And look at that. I mean, come on. Quidditch, get out of here. Ooh, very nice. Little Boba Fett action from Mandalorian. I like that. Always love all the Harry Potter stuff. Next, we got Ruby says Hagrid's umbrella now. That is really cool. Ooh, they got a Mandrake. Let's see if he's still crying. Ah! Yep, he's still crying. Okay, sadly, once again, I wasn't able to film at the register. A lot of people are not real comfortable with it. I guess I get really spoiled with my favorite Barnes & Nobles. They just love me so much there. We were able to find two more of these Yu-Gi-Oh! tins. That's six total. We actually only need one more now to complete the seven that he was trying to find. But then we were also able to get two of these Evolving Skies packs. And you know I had to get my favorite boy, Mr. Umbreon. So let's go ahead and head back to the cave, open up some of the stuff. We're probably going to open up one of those Yu-Gi-Oh! tins too. We found a lot of stuff on our hunt with Casey on Wednesday as well as this Friday. I've had an amazing time with every single one of y'all. And thank y'all so much for taking some time out of your day to join me on this hunt. But let's go ahead and head back to the cave. I'll make it quick for you guys as always. Woo! And we're back in the cave. Thank you guys so much once again for joining me on that hunt. I had an absolute blast with Casey on Wednesday as well as each and every one of you on Friday. So y'all are absolutely incredible. Happy Saturday once again to you guys. I also got a little clip that I wanted to show of me and Miss M actually building our little Umbreon over there. Wasn't able to show it actually in our last Last live, so I want to throw that in right now. It's super cute. So me and Miss Amaret build a bear. They got a bunch of awesome stuff. You guys know why I'm here. Get me an Umbreon. But they got some Pikachu's and Eevees are actually on sale, two for 45 right now. So if you got a build a bear, go check it out. But I really want to get this Hedwig too. Mm. They got Toothless and his girlfriend. Oh, I want that too. And then they got Miss M's favorite, Mr. Stitch. Do you want one? Miss M's getting her a Toothless. So they got some dark types over here. That's right. Umbi's getting stuff. Look at that. Stuff in the feet, the tail. Oh man. Oh man. I'm sorry, Umbi. I didn't want her to do this. But it had to be done. He's all finished. He has his heart right there, though. We, get, we still got to put that in there. But he has sounds, too. We got our babies. And mine talks. <laughs> <laughs> you can't really hear, but it's okay. Oh, you like yours, baby? Yeah. Good. Our darkness brothers. Yeah. Yeah. Even got a birth certificate right there. Mm hmm. Toothless got one, too. Oh, I love this Umbreon so much. He's so adorable. So now it's time for us to open up some of the stuff that we actually got today. I actually wanted to start off with actually the Yu-Gi-Oh! 10. One of the 10s that we actually picked up for my buddy. Hoping that he pulls something awesome out of one of these for him. And then I wanted to open up some of the sleeve packs that we got. We got two Chilling Rains and two Evolving Skies. Both with my boy Umbreon on them. So I can't wait to pop these things open. And then I thought we'd finish off by opening up the Zashin V Union box. Cannot wait to dive into this thing. Hopefully there's not an error pack like the last time. But let's go ahead and get this thing started and dive into our Yu-Gi-Oh! 10. Alright, here we go. Let's go ahead get this thing started. I love this Yu-Gi-Oh! 10 so much, guys. I've been out of the Yu-Gi-Oh! card game for a long time, but my buddy Don Rob actually told me I can keep one of these. We got six total, so I get to keep one. Not the cards inside. Those are all his, but I definitely want to have some cool place to put my Yu-Gi-Oh! cards that we open. 
Oh, this thing's awesome. All right, let's go ahead and get into this thing. Come on, come on, Yu-Gi-Oh! 10. If this is your first time to the cave, guys, welcome, welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back. I do appreciate all the support that we get here. This community is absolutely amazing, and it's because of you guys that we get to do cool stuff like this. Look at that. We got our blue eyes, white dragon, and a little bit of dark magician. Very nice. All right, let's go ahead and dive into these things. I have no idea what is in this, guys. All right, here we go. We got a 2021 10 of Ancient Battles Mega Pack. Mega Pack, huh? Okay. We got three of these total in this tin. Wow, that's, that's all. We just got three packs in the tin? Okay, okay. I still love the look of that tin now. Look at that thing. So gorgeous. We got one prismatic secret rare, two ultra rares, two super rares, one rare, and 12 commons in every single pack. Wow, these things are lit. I hope Pokemon does something like this someday. All right, let's go ahead and open up this thing. We'll put our 10 right there, and let's go ahead and dive into our first pack. All right, I know a few of the cards that he is looking for in here. He actually sent me a picture of them. So hopefully we get one of those in this first opening. I have no idea what the card trick is. We're about to find out right now uh, from our first pack, and then I'll do the actual card trick for the last two packs. So here we go. Oh, this is a thick pack right there, guys. Look at all those cards. All right, we got Squeak Knight. I'm not gonna say all these names, just the ones that I can actually pronounce. Deep Sea Sentry, looking very cool. Curse of Dragon, very nice, the Cursed Dragon. Oh, that's an old school shout out right there from the original Yu-Gi-Oh. Ooh, we got a little puppy, that's cute too. Ooh, Torpedo Takedown, like that. Ooh, Gusari, I like that too. Ooh, very nice, so there's the Hollow right there. I guess that's our first rare of the day. Artillery Catapult Turtle. Very nice. That's super OG right there. Yugi used to use this one. That's awesome. Oop. Inferno Arms. Very nice. Little spell card right there. So there's our second hollow. Oh, very nice. Fusion Deployment. I like that too. All right. Let's see what our next one is. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, nice. Dogmata Aiden the Enlightened. So this is actually, I think, the gold hollow from this one. That's really cool looking. Oh, that's awesome. All right, let's see our last card. Oh, very nice. Virtual World Kieran, a lily. God, these cards are gorgeous right here. Let's see what our next card is. Oh, sales pitch. I like that too, with a little pot of greed action going. Oh, we got a little name I cannot pronounce right there. Go ahead and go to the next one. We got a Witchcrafter's Guinea. We got an Adam Mansler. Yep, nope, not even gonna try. Oh, we got another little finny there. It looked, it looked like our little puppy. Oh, that's nice. Light dragon. Oh, that's really cool looking. Not one he is looking for, but I know he's going to enjoy it still. Oh, we got Draco's lamp right there. And I think that's our last card. All right, cool. So it looked like one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so, so six from the back. Let's go ahead and remember that so we can go ahead and open up our next pack. And then we know that the hits are going to be at the end. All right, here we go. Next pack. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hoping he gets something that he is looking for, guys. These tins, once again, are really cool. I love that there's 18 cards in each of these packs. That's a lot of cards. That is a lot of cards. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, so let's go ahead and flip this thing over, see what we got. Ooh, very nice. We've got an Infernoble Knight Astrolfo. I think that's how you say it. I have no idea. I'm butchering these names. Dogmatic Encounter, like that. Oh, look, we got another pony there. Melify Pony. We're getting a lot of Melify things. Oh, I like that, too. It looks like a cicada. That's awesome. Execution of the Contract. Very nice. Got a little Rose Girl looking cute. Oh, Indulge Dark Lord. Oh, that's cool. I've never seen a car that actually has two different colors on it like that. Fairy and a Pendulum car. That's pretty cool looking. Oh, we got Gorku, Iron Claw. Ooh, a lot of little light craft. That's nice too. Tie strike. Ooh, very cool. Got a little fishy. Oh, nice. All right, so here comes our rares. Here we go. Oh, that's really cool. A little turn trooper. I like that. Oh, Phantom Knights of the Stained Greaves. Very cool looking too. Ooh, I guess that's our ultra rare, I think. I have no idea. Got a luminous lunar dragon. Oh, that's awesome. Dude, these, these actual cards look just gorgeous. I love how they shine. Oh, another Dogmatica character right there. Got Theo the Iron Punch. Very nice. Up, oh, opening of the Spirit Gate. Awesome card, too. I guess that's our gold rare in this one. So our last card is. Oh, very nice. Virtual World Dragon. Long, long. That is really cool looking, too. 
Still not one that he was looking for from this set, but I gotta say, these cards are really awesome looking. So yeah, six from the back is the card trick, guys. Six from the back. All right, here we go. We got our last pack. Mega pack, I should say, from this tin. We still got five more of these tins to open, guys. We're gonna sp uh, sporadically open these uh, just so we can actually make this Yu-Gi-Oh! content last a little bit longer for my buddy. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and six. All right, let's see what we got in this one. Ooh, very nice wing Pegasus. That This artwork is just gorgeous from Yu-Gi-Oh! Got a little rookie action spell card. Lifeless Leaf Fish. That's pretty cool, too. Ooh, Dogmatic Nation. Very nice. I guess that may work with all the Dogma cards. Ravenous Croc Dragon. That's pretty cool looking, too. Free Range Monsters. Ooh, we got a little Raptite. That's interesting. A little Crystal Action. Ooh, Melfi Tag. We put a lot of Melfies there, so that's pretty cool. Resonator Command. Very nice. Ooh, we got a Disposable Learning Device. Okay, interesting. Goki Guts, like that. Deep Sea Minestrel, very cool. Ooh, very nice, I like that. A little Linger Boa, oh, it's like Karibo. Uh, I guess that's how you say it, Linger Bio, Linger -E -Bio? I don't know, I have no idea how to say it, well, that's an awesome looking card right there. Ooh, very nice, Super Heavy Samurai, I like that too. All right, here comes our hits. Here they are. Oop, I got a little Cross Sheep action, looking pretty cool too. All these are actual Beast Links. So these are interesting. Are all these going to be link cards? No, they are not. King Beast Barbaros. That's awesome looking too. Look at that gold card. Absolutely gorgeous cards in here. Oh! Apparently, this is the chase card. Wow! We got out of our first 10. What? That is nuts. He just sent me a pick of this one. This is the one he's wanting to pull the most. What? First 10 magic. All right, let's see what's behind it. We got a virtual world gate. Wing long. That's awesome, too. Want to put that cross designer right there to be super careful with it. And that is our last card, actually, in that pack, guys. Wow. First 10 magic right there. Gotta love that. Let's go ahead and get a sleeve for this bad boy. Sleeve is definitely too big for it. Yu-Gi-Oh card's a little bit smaller than Pokemon. Oh, man. He's going to be ecstatic. First 10, that's what I'm talking about. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and dive into our packs. Let's go ahead and start with our Chilling Rains. Cannot believe we just did that for him. That is nuts, nuts. Don Rob, you know I got you, bro. You know I got you. Let's go ahead and dive into this thing. Oh, we got a little bit of Moltres on the front of that Chilling Rain pack. Let's see if we can get a good card for us. Let's see if we can get one of our Chase cards in this opening too. Super glad we got that for him though, super glad. All right, we have yet to get any kind of alt art or, or any kind of like crazy hit from Chilling Rain. So if we can get one today, that'd be nuts too. All right, let's go Fire Energy because it was a Moltres on the front. Oh, there we go, starting it off right. Got a little Galarian chest plate, got a Flaffy, Path to the Peak, got a Shfeel, a little Yam Mask action, got the Swirlix, Cast Form, Cast Form again, but Crocheted, love that one. Ooh, we got a little Passimian Reverse, not too bad, Reverse Rare. Oh, and a Gengar, shout out to Old Time right there, Gengar Hollow. Very nice. I will get a sleeve for this one, but only because I want to make sure it is nice and safe before I donate it to the kids' packs. Look at that Gengar. All right, let's go ahead and put that thing right there. Nice start so far, though. Can't complain about that. Let's give that code card away right there for that Chillin' Rain pack, though. Can't forget that. And let's go ahead and dive into our next one. We got a Articuno on the front. Ooh, we got a Ice Rider Calyrex on the pack card. All right, come on, Ice Rider. Come on, Ice Rider. You just heard me say we have yet to get a crazy card out of Chilling Rain. Can you change that for us? We're about to find out. All right, it was Ice Rider, so I'm going to go Water Energy for this one. Oh, Electric. Well, you know, our streak had to end at some point. At one. Got a Scroll of the Skies. Got a Curlia. Little Fog Crystal. Got the Cast Form. Ghastly. Got a little Cup Foo. Got the Hatina. Sobble training like Naruto underneath that waterfall. Galarian Yamask Reverse. Oh, and a Zeb Strike is going to be the rare for that one. So one for two from our Chilling Rain. Can't complain about that. Let's go ahead and give away the code card for that last pack, though. And dive on into our Evolving Skies. I cannot choose which one to do first because they both got Umber in on the front. Let's hope we got a good pack art. Oh, we got a Ray Ray pack art. Love that. All right, here we go. Come on, Ray Ray. Bring us something cool. Still loving if we can get any kind of alt art or a VMAX I don't have out of this. I'll go crazy. All right, it's a Ray Ray pack, so I'm going back to tried and true. We're going fire energy. Oh, I got a steel. That's all right. Got a digging gloves. Got a little palpito. Got a crustal. 
We got a Lotad, Sableye, got a Teddy Ursa, little Mareep action, got the Zoroa, Lombre Reverse, not bad. Oh, and a Gigalith is going to be the rare for that one. So nothing crazy for my first pack of Evolving Skies. Thankfully, we got one more sleeve right here. Come on, Umby. Can we get matching pack arts? Oh, we cannot get matching pack cards. We got a Sylveon pack. Want to make sure I give away the code card for that last pack right there. Can't forget it. And let's go ahead and dive into our Sylveon pack. Come on, Sylvie. Come on, Sylvie. I think you probably have brought me my best hits that I've gotten so far out of Evolving Skies. Can you do it one more time? All right, it was Sylveon pack. I want to go Psychic Energy for this one. Oh, guys, I am a Psychic here. We got a little Boost Shake. We got a Rabambi. A little Avalug looking cool. We got a Bag On. Love Disc. We got a little C Dot. Slack Off. We got a Flubay Bay. Ooh, very nice. Reverse Rare Curin. I like that. Oh, very nice. We got a Suicune V. Oh, very cool. That is a dupe for me, but you know what? No worries whatsoever. I can definitely find a use for it. Let's go ahead and sleeve that thing up. Look at that silly coon. Go ahead and put him right there. That's what I'm talking about. I always love that. There's that code card right there. I hope it's a lucky one for you guys too. And now it's time. We got to open up our Zashin V Union box. I love these V Union cards. Probably not my absolute favorite one. I'm definitely going to say that the Mewtwo is going to be my number two. Love me some Greninja. Well, we still got to find the Mewtwo one. All right, Zashin. Come on out. Come on out to play, Mr. Zashian. Oh my goodness, guys. Let me know if you guys have been able to find some of these in the wild. We found the uh, Greninja one in our last video. Found the Zashian one in this one. So hopefully in our video next week, we're able to find a Mewtwo. Oh man, that would be awesome. If we can complete the set that quickly, that would be crazy. Let's go ahead and get this thing out of there. Thankfully our big card, it shifted a little bit, but it just shifted back. Oh guys. I love, I love, love, love how they split up these cards. They basically made it like Yu-Gi-Oh. We got our own version of Exodia now in Pokemon. I love that. That's just awesome. Oh, this card is just gorgeous. So gorgeous. All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and take our packs out. Ray Ray. Ooh, very nice. We got a Zapdos from Chilling Rain. He brings us good hits. Got a Pikachu from Vivid Voltage. And then we got a Lapras, one of my favorite water types from Sword and Shield. All right, here we go. I'm feeling some luckiness coming out of these packs, guys. Let's see if we can get it right. We're going to go Sword and Shield first. Then we'll go Chilling Rain, then Vivid Voltage, and then end off on Evolving Skies. All right, here we go. Come on, Sword and Shield. What we got for us? What you got for us? Let me know the best hits that you guys have been getting out of these V Union boxes. I know in our last video, we actually got an error pack, so I'm hoping that we get something cool out of this one. I think we actually got well, a V card out of our last one. It was a Snorlax, though, so I was happy about that. All right, let's go ahead and flip this thing over. Let's go Water Energy because it was a Lapras. Oh, we got a Fighting. That's all right. A little rab boot, got the Ferrothorn, thorn, little switch action going on, got the crabby, rookity, got a rye horn, little chewdle action, got the cottony, oop, great ball reverse, not bad. Oh, and a Rillaboom is gonna be our first hit of that box. Very nice. Got a hollow action, Rillaboom. Very cool looking. All right, let's go ahead and sleeve this bad boy up right here. Definitely going into the donation pack. Go ahead and put him right beside Gengar. Make sure to give away the code for that last pack of Sword and Shield. Always got to remember. And if I forgot about the Evolving Skies one, there it is right there. All right, let's go ahead and dive into our Chilling Rain. Come on, Zapdos. Let's go. Let's get a good hit. Come on, Zappy. Come on, buddy. I know you want to give me a good hit, Zapdos. I know you do. Come on. Come on. All right, since it was Zapdos, because he's fighting in this set, let's go fighting energy. Oh, we got a Leaf. That's all right. Got a little Expedition uniform. Got a Hatrim. Flaffy. Got the Cast form. Hatina. A little Aeron action. Got the Ralts. Venipede. Rabu Reverse. Oh, and a Vol Corona is going to be the rare for that one. So nothing crazy from that pack. That's okay, though. Don't want to forget to give away the code card from that Chillin' Rain pack. Hope it's lucky for you guys. Let's go ahead and dive on into our Pikachu. Come on, Vivid Voltage. Pikachu on the front. Can we finally pull the Rainbow Chunkachu that I've been hunting for for so long? We're about to find out right now. Come on, Pikachu. Let's go ahead and flip this thing over because it was a Pikachu pack. You know we're going electric. Oh, we got a Leaf Energy. That's okay. Got a little Nessa, got the Nuzz Leaf, Wash Energy, got a Poochiena, little Rock Rough, two dogs back to back, love it. Got a little Blitzel, Skidoo, Ferris Seed, 
Woo Bat Reverse, not bad. See so what our last card is, is something good? Oh, it's gonna be a Hollow Electrode. That's okay though, that's okay. Let's go ahead and sleeve up this Electrode here so he can be protected for the kids packs. Looks like he's about to use Explosion right there. Love that artwork. Let's go ahead and put him right there. Give away the code card for that Vivid Volt pack right there. And dive into our last pack from that box. Come on, Ray Ray. Come on, Ray Ray. I need one good hit out of this box, buddy. Can you bring it to me? We're about to find out. All right, let's go. You know what, Ray Ray? I'm feeling fire energy for this one. Ah, oh, electric, that's okay. Got a little digging gloves, got the stormy mountains, a shell gone, got a little Psyduck living his best life. Eevee, always love that Eevee artwork. Little cutie fly, got a Pikachu, Applin. Digging gloves reverse, not bad. Let's see what our last card is in there. Oh, 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 guys, we got some rainbow. Oh, very nice. A Lycan Rock V Max Rainbow. Wow, that V Union box was way better than the last one to us. Oh, I love me some Lycan Rock. Was hoping that it was going to be an Evolution Rainbow, but that's okay. I love me some Lycan Rock, guys, especially the dust form. This thing is absolutely gorgeous. Let's go ahead and get a sleeve for this. That's how you end it right there. Last pack magic right there. Oh, Lycan Rock. Welcome home, buddy. Welcome home. Wow, so not only were we able to get the chase card for my buddy out of the first Yu-Gi-Oh! 10, we also picked up a Lycan Rock Rainbow Rare from our Union Box. Absolutely crazy opening. I had to finish it like that. Thank you guys so much for joining me on that hunt on the opening. If you guys enjoyed this content, make sure you leave a big old like down below. It's absolutely free, and I cannot tell you how much it helps the channel, guys. Thank y'all so much for that. And I'll see each and every one of you that can make it on Sunday. We're actually going to be starting at 8 30 on this Sunday instead of 8 so I have a little bit more time after work to actually get ready and prepare but we're going to be opening up a lot of tins it's going to be a tin party on Sunday cannot wait for that make sure you do go check out some of our previous videos in the meantime though and as always make sure you subscribe down there so you don't miss out on any of the future fun y'all have a wonderful Saturday or whatever day it is for you I hope it's a great one y'all know how we ended here as always in the cave from me to you happy hunting